The following program may contain language of an adult nature. Listener discretion is advised. Views and opinions expressed on the following program are those of the hosts and guests, and not necessarily those of the staff or management of altorcradio.net. If you don't know, you better ask somebody. My boy Maxwell Silver Hammer and my bottom bitch jerk man will set you straight with some good all true shit and none of the shit that irks me. Hey Maxi baby, I still got them videos. You fill my cereal port perfectly. Bitch. Ah uh, yes! Finally kick those fuckers off the air. It's about goddamn time I got sick of those fucks. Yeah, that G.J. Jerkman and Maxwell Silverhammer with all their goddamn co- anti you know what? talk. I'm, I'm, just be happy. We're going to go celebrate right now. Oh. I think we should go do some golf and butt fuck one another. Oh, that's the greatest. I'm ready. Hold on. Uh, go get in the car here. Get the hell away the other side. Another side. There you go. There we go. All right. This is a great day. <laughs> I'm gonna start it up now. You ready? These bastards. Let's go. Yeah. Bora Bora, here we go. It's the Still Radio Show. Maxwell Silverham, GJ Jerkman, Cruise Control, and G. Motor. Do you smell fire? I think somebody lit a cigarette. No, it's the hottest radio show on the internet. So keep it locked here from 7 to 9. Cause it's STEM radio fam, they ahead of their time. And now it's lesson one, man. This is lesson two. No format because they keep it fresh and new. And this is what I call HQ. A whip. You're a musical genius, man. They can't paint it like a face is. But if the content is making you sick, taste some they quill. And if you think that the jocks are quirky, allow me to introduce you to the shit that Spread them cheeks! It's the end of the holy shit, it's motherfucking hot. God damn it. Shit that fucking cock sucking irks me. End of the week edition. AIDS attrition. I am Cruise Control, Melton not here in Eugene. And I'm Maxwell Silverhammer. Um, you know, I get to go home to an air-conditioned house and I might go to the pool tonight. You know? Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> why, why do I do this again? I, I don't know why I do this again. Because why you, do I put up with this? Because you know why? It's it's once a week and you need it, man. It's it's therapy. It's going to help you. It's therapy. It's going to help me. Oh, that, now you sound like a cult leader. It's therapy. It's going to help you, my son. It will, you know. To be the best you can. It's a therapy, therapeutic thing to <laughs> be on the show and learn and let out your anger and, and your negative energies into the, into the airwaves so that people can, can absorb them and take some of the stress that's on your shoulders. Oh, it actually, no, I wasn't even thinking about that part. I was just thinking about the, the ripping on your part. You know, because you kind of need me to rip on you every week, you know? Oh, rip rip on me. No, I need that. No, you see, you just need you need to rip on somebody and since uh, G Motors isn't around anymore. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, and Jerkman's not around too much, so, you know, we can yeah, rip, exactly. rip so, on his so podcast. Neither, neither, so neither of them are around, so you can't actually do that either. Because it's so fun if they're not around. Right? No, of course not. Of course not. So. I mean, <laughs> you know. Losers don't want to come around. It's all good, dude. Yeah, you know how it is. They get in their own little bullshit, and you know. Well, one one of them went to you know had to had to follow his family because not his wife or anything. Because uh, <laughs> but his. You know, um, <laughs> oh wow, <laughs> that's funny, and man. Then another one, another one couldn't follow his wife. <laughs> oh, <laughs> uh, yeah, that's true. She followed somebody else. <laughs> you know, he's sitting, he's sitting there going, oh, you fuck. You know what? You fuck. <laughs> Probably at oh, home. What are, what are you, you going to do? Yeah, exactly. Anyway, so, uh, so what's going on? Let's see. You want to talk about, uh, you sent me a thing about, this, I looked at this Digi Extreme. It's just, uh, it's just like, it doesn't seem like anything remarkable. Uh, what, what well, the, what's the story? Here, here? Here's the thing, man. I get a Facebook message yesterday from somebody we both know. I'll give you a hint. It's, hey, dude. Oh, okay. yeah. Okay. <laughs> and he tells me to call him because he just hit paid. I don't know. How to, what was the term he used? I just struck gold, man. You got to call me. And, you know. Oh, shit. <laughs> you, thought, you think things would change. You think he would. You thought it was out of that phase, after the knives and... Yeah, the knives and the vacuums and the whatever other 
things he was into. So yeah. I thought, well, all right, you know, I, um, if anything, I just thought, oh, go ahead. Yeah, you just want to give, give him a call and see how he's doing, right? Yeah, I haven't talked to him in a while, and, you know, maybe he found one of his DJ Needle tapes that I made back in the day or something, you know, which I think would be kind of cool because I don't have them anymore, you know. So mm -hmm. anyway, I call him up, and he goes, uh, yeah, man, I got this thing. It's called the Digi Extreme, and, you know, I've demoed this thing for everybody, and, and there's not been one demo where I haven't sold one. And I'm like, well, what the hell is it? And apparently it's just some kind of, you know, I mean, fuck, you pretty much can do the same thing from your tablet or phone, right? It turns it turns your TV into a tab, which is which is okay. It's not, that's not, you know, if you want to have, if it's prob have probably, what, 50 bucks about that? No, man, he told me it's 250. Are you kidding? Oh, fuck that. Dude. <laughs> well, and he wasn't trying, what it was is, and because he knew to his credit, he was like, yeah, man, he's like, I know you can't, you know, you'd probably have trouble navigating with it because there's no screen reading software. But you know what he wanted me to do, because I do radio, he wanted to give me a code so I can, like, sell it for him. And so, you know what I'm saying? Like, so, you know, call this number and give him code 61522. Is he, he going to give you any, any money for it? Yeah, well, dude, every time, I, I wish I had a dollar for every time somebody told me they give me money for something I was well, going to put. I'm just, I'm just saying, like, if he even offer you know, I kind of cut him off before he got a chance to spit out the offer, because <laughs> I was like, well, I'd like to know more about this thing before I do anything, man, you know? So I, I was like, can you send me some... It doesn't look bad. It's just, I want to see something, though. I'm doing some research here. Okay. I, I tried to I've look... Actually, I've actually got it brought up, and it's uh, we're bringing up Amazon.com right now. Hmm. The fact that it's, it's on Amazon. It's, it's three hundred and thirty-nine. Yeah, it's on Amazon. It's 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 a it's. Let me see. It's got sixty-seven reviews, four stars. Okay, it's pretty decent. Um, not bad. Um, but it's it's normally three hundred and thirty-nine dollars, but it's one seventy-seven forty. How is? Let's see. Wait a second. <laughs> That's a big drop, get, man. Like, Let's see. It's got a Android ARM dual core A9, uh, da, 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 one gigabyte DDR3, eight gigabyte, uh, th uh, let's see, eight gigabyte flash drive, so full HD, 1080p. It looks okay, but there's things that, that probably do it just as well for a lot less for a lot less price, or you could do the same thing. Although the the, the, the retail price on Amazon's a hell of a lot less than he's doing it. Well, well, that's what I'm saying. Amazon's selling it for cheaper, even. <laughs> so, yeah, like, why would you go through him when you can get on Amazon? You can get two days, and Amazon will replace everything I, for you. I'm just wondering how you even get into that kind of thing, man. How you even wind up selling this shit? Where where do you go? Where do you you know find these jobs or whatever they're called? <laughs> you just you you people you have opportunities. You want to get rich rich quick and, and make money and think it's going to be the new way of the future. But this is like the wave of 2000. Well, I was gonna say that's kind of old school, right? I mean, it's not necessarily old school. I mean, it's older it's school. Games. It's got you know movies and stuff. I mean, but it's probably you can probably run your own. I mean, see. it just doesn't sound like something that you know. I, I'm just trying to find a, a a thing to make it you know why it would be cool. Like, what's the advantage of having it? You know what I'm saying? Um, if you don't have the internet um you don't have a computer uh you don't you have a big screen tv you don't want to have any take up any space you just plug it in the back of your tv um it uh picks up signal although <laughs> although you need internet to run it. you need internet to run it though wouldn't you yeah you do so but most of the time you have it a lot, a lot you know you'd be very surprised how many people with uh with wi-fi don't actually have computers these are for their phones Oh, okay. Uh, that's only <laughs> only their phones. Believe me, it happens all. I hear it all the time. People try to play their Xboxes by streaming shit through their what through their fucking phone. <laughs> Dumbasses, dude. Uh, <laughs> like using it as why is that? Like I, I can't download this shit, man. I can't download this. Shit. It's taking forever. Your goddamn server. What are you using? Well, I'm, I'm using my 4G network, dude. Broski. <laughs> uh, using 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 your hot your phone as a hotspot. Yeah. Well, you're. And they wonder why their data plan is ass ramming them too, right? Exactly. So they have they get to call up Xbox and fucking AT&T. <laughs> oh wow, yeah. I, I believe me, if people do that, it's it's. I don't really know. I mean, I'm looking. 
it's not really i mean it's not a bad thing i guess but it's not a no it's, no, it's not it's not a rip i mean it's let's see because i even tried to put it i tried to see if it was a scam or if it was you know some bad things were said about it or anything but you know i couldn't find any negatives you know it was all just you know that it's hey it's this thing and it's this device and i did see it was on amazon i was like oh wow they're actually selling that okay but i just don't see the allure to it i guess like why would you buy that thing it seems like just another toy really so you know kind of like uh, but in, in well, it's not it's not necessarily it's, it's just like it's like the amazon a lot, of people, a lot of people have these things um but it's it's like a um it's like roku you ever heard of roku or the google oh. the google thing they stick in the back of your tv oh, okay i've heard of those yep yeah. yep the roku or whatever it's called yeah, so it's uh, well. It's nothing, nothing spectacular. I mean, I wouldn't pay two hundred twenty dollars for it. I wouldn't pay one hundred sixty dollars for it. <laughs> yeah, it's nothing I would buy, but no, you can get you can get some similar similar type of things for less money, and, um, and probably a little bit from a little well more well known and and, um, and and I don't really see. I mean, I've had people tell me a million times, oh, you know, if you you know promote my shit on your show or talk about my business, I'll give you the percentages and all this other thing. I've never had any anything from that so and uh, and one person in particular I actually gave a friend of mine their info and they used them I know this <laughs> and they you know and I still never got anything from it so you know fuck it <laughs> but wow. man well you gotta love uh, that's, that's something that yeah it's, it's just uh it's just another streaming device. Now, it looks like it's getting good reviews. 69 reviews isn't really that many, though, on Amazon. No. Um, like, uh, let's put it this way. If you compare it to something like the Roku, watch. Uh, well, I'll just, just, just after shits and giggles, I'll uh, look it up here. All right, see what the Roku has. See if they have Roku. any. Roku. What? The, how many reviews do they have? There's a bunch of them. 6,514. Oh. And there's one with 649. There's one with 383. There's a bunch with 14,000, 3,000. Yeah, that's Digi Extreme. I'm going to look it up again. Digi Extreme. Let's see. So they uh, sound like they're just trying to compete with all the other devices, pretty much. <laughs> one more one more toy, which pretty much I can do this shit on my, t on my computer anyway <laughs> if I wanted. Yeah, Digi know. Extreme 67, and there's that's pretty much all there is Ooh. here. Well, okay. nah, nah, I, that doesn't, it's, I mean, come on. Now. I mean, he's making it like it's the wave of the future and it's the best thing since fucking toilet paper and. It's, it's just a way to stream movies on your TV. It's not right. fucking big deal. You yeah. can do it on your Xbox. You can buy an Xbox 360 for 200 for the same price and, and have, get internet on that, play games, and stream all your shit through other apps. So it's kind of like. And the, get on it's kind of like the uh, technological uh, Cutco, then, huh? Yeah, I, yeah, it's the same thing. It's just a, you know, you got to download their firmware, and you have to, you have to make sure they're, and it's not using Jelly Bean. <laughs> Jelly Bean, uh, Jelly Bean, uh, Android Jelly Bean is older. Like Ice Cream uh, Sandwich is newer, I think. Uh, yeah, they're up to something new now, aren't they? That's Jelly, Jelly Bean, Bean was like. Out, I'm gonna, yeah, I'm gonna find out when that came out. Cause that's the one. They're four point two two. See. Yeah, that was like 2011 or something, or 2012. <laughs> Even way before I mean, I that, had huh? that. I had that like three phones ago. Um, <laughs> wow. Oh, so that's, so it's probably, yeah, it's probably one of the later, you know, well, you'll see. Let's see, Android, uh, uh, yeah, okay. Uh, on October, <laughs> Jelly Bean is the name given to, the, to three major point releases on Android. June 2012. Yeah, that's what I thought it was, 2012. <laughs> yeah, so, something, it's 4.1. What's the newest version of Android? I'm going to find out here. All right. Yeah, because they have something, they have different shit since then. I know that. Newest Android. Listen to that. You can hear him typing. He's he's so professional back there. Oh, go fuck yourself, man. <laughs> yeah, they're up to they're up to KitKat, 4.4 now. Oh, wow. <laughs> but that doesn't necessarily mean it's going to be bad. Actually, 5.0 Lollipop release date is coming out on this next. Oh, okay. So it's, it's, it's several years old, So, but that's the thing. It's several years old, and so this product is probably several years old. <laughs> wow. Um, and it's only got 67 reviews, so. Hmm. 
Yeah. I mean, it, it's almost got as, as little views as your show on YouTube. Oh, uh, damn. <laughs> hey, you know what? I don't care, man. You know, that's, you know. I, you know you don't care. That's why I say it, dude. I, I don't really give a shit. I'm like, yeah, hey, what the fuck ever. Hey, you give a shit, but you don't have to lie to me, man. Yeah, uh, well. I know, you, I know you're looking for that one moment, that one person to listen to you and, and realize what you are. Right, the big break. Get that big break, man. Get that big break, man. Well, how do you is know it's... Fucking, is there a fucking cricket in there somewhere? Um, Yeah, actually, there is. <laughs> it's funny. You hear it? I fucking hear that motherfucking thing. Why, you know, why is there a cricket in your... In this, a cricket in a fucking radio studio? Well, that's, like, real professional there. <laughs> well, I mean... Why don't you put a fucking a hive in there and have some bees flying around? <laughs> Jesus Christ, well, man. Maybe, well, maybe have a fucking, have a fucking uh, bird in the corner. <laughs> or a fucking maybe a wolf walk in and howl at the middle of someone's show. Well, we can't <laughs> we can't really control uh, when the crickets come in. You know what I'm saying? What do you mean you fucking put some find that damn thing? It makes a noise. You listen to it's your hiding. Come on, sonar boy. It's hiding click in your, a, your, it's hiding in a wall, tongue. man. Click your tongue and make something happen, dude. You fucking you're a ninja, man. You're blind. You got that sonar. Yeah, yeah, exactly. <laughs> You're you're in you're in dickhead mode tonight, huh? <laughs> like, oh, fuck you. <laughs> so, uh, although I got to talk. Speaking of technology, man, here's something kind of cool. I got a lot of stuff to talk about, actually. Oh, uh, okay, okay, cool. So yeah, so we both. But, so well, here's here's one thing that's kind of cool though, kind of on on the technology um, subject. RTC is doing something uh, where they text you. Um, you can get text alerts. So, you know, like if they're, um, you know, they'll, they'll text you your rides for the next day so you know what, what time your rides are going to be. They'll also text you when your ride is like 10 minutes away. And or you can, you can set up the time, you know what I'm saying? You can say, like, I want to know when it's five minutes away or 10 minutes away or something. So that's I pick. Cool. And then, yeah, and it also texts you when it's there, when that, they've arrived. That, now, that's cool, but that's another thing that's like 2000. Five-ish? Well, yeah, but the fact we're talking about RTC, <laughs> though, man, the most non -pro I mean, non progressive. We can, we can text you. You can even use your pager. <laughs> well, you know that's the thing, though, that they've taken. I'm glad they're finally doing this because uh, you know they're non, you know, your typical non progressive ass government agency, and uh, you know, like how, how many? Uh, fuck, I used to want them to. Uh, still it still be nice to set your rides up online. You wouldn't have to call. You know, you still got to call. Oh, yeah. Still yeah, got to call, and, you know, because I got to keep that that you know, which I don't mind in some ways. But yeah, I wish I could. You could just set up on, online to be awesome. Yeah, and then just get an email confirmation or something that you know, here are your rides for tomorrow, and then you'd be done with it. So I think that would be a little more. But that they never. A lot of government agencies aren't very progressive, man. Well, no, no, they. They are like uh, Social Security is that way. You know, they can't email you. It's all got to be done over the phone so they can convenient. Yeah, because they, they, so they can keep the, their the bureaucrats jobs. Oh, yeah. They need to keep a certain amount of jobs. So right. That, so that, uh, you know, they can get, get, get their funding. Yeah. And they need to come in so they can so they can, you know, get their fucking claws into you. And yeah, exactly. Or even with the payments. Some fucking counselor somewhere about. Well, you know the or the stupid fucking payments, you know that we're supposed to do supposedly, you know, which I haven't paid in probably about a year, you know. <laughs> you know. I pay, with my, I pay with my tax return, man. Yeah, that's what I do. I, I figure you get a big chunk yeah, of money from me. So taking three, three to five hundred dollars a fucking year at least. From yeah. Already. That's how I'm feeling. Kidding. It's funny because my mom, you know, is like, "Well, you gotta pay them," and I'm like, "I'm no, I don't gotta pay." You know, she's like, "It's you know, I'm telling you, it's twenty bucks. It's gonna go in your," and I'm just like. Who cares? Yeah, I said half the time I try to call, they, you know, I can't get through to speak to anyone. On your credit, is that what they said? She said. Yeah, she said something about it. It'll go on my credit. I'm, I'm like, mom, it's never gonna leave my credit. It's gonna stay on yeah. my credit. You know. That's what I'm saying, mine's there. I've already got, if I got bad credit now, I have bad credit now. Whatever. Right. You know. Exactly. That's I've already, I've always had. I've always had fucking shit. My credit's like negative forty. <laughs> Well, who has good credit anymore? You fucking FICA score. You a, you a fuck a score because you fucking <laughs> fucked up somewhere. Well, FICA, man. Well, who's got good credit anyway? It's like, for, it's for Micah. For, for, for Micah score. Yeah, exactly. But, <laughs> fucking bite the bite the for Micah score. Dig, dig your teeth into the for Micah. I call it, I call it the fuck it score because I'll never, I can't even get like, it's like, you want to get an introductory credit card? Please sign up now. All right. Yeah. Fuck you. We won't even touch you. <laughs> it's kind of good. They leave you alone, though. You know? Thank God you can get an ATM card. 
Jesus Christ. <laughs> I'm serious. Thank God I have an ATM card. Cause That's all I use, man. I mean, no reason yeah, to have anything else. <laughs> I don't use shit anymore. I, I get cash out, and then I get cash out, and I think, oh, and, and I, this is how the world's changed. I get cash out, and I look at my bank statement and go, oh, shit, man. I'm kind of low on cash. Uh, wait a minute, man. Like, wait a second, dude. You cash is He's got cash out. You have cash, but that's not in my account. <laughs> you know, I did the same thing. Like, you know what I'm saying? oh, like, no, yeah. man. I just took like, out 40 oh. bucks. Yeah. It's like, uh, well, yeah, you've got 40 bucks in your fucking pocket, so use that 40 bucks, and you won't use your cash for two or three days or your, your account. So it's the same fucking thing. But no, not anymore. It's not. Because you think, at least I don't, I don't think so. It's like you think, because, uh, like, you know, you're so technologically sound. You're so convenient. You have the card. Like, I buy everything online. Yeah. Get it shipped to me. Yep. Dude, I wanna, I'm, when I get some more money, I'm going to get to get Prime, Amazon Prime. I'm going to get that again and have groceries shipped to me. Fucking, fucking non-perishables. Oh. Hand food, soda, shit like that. Damn, really? They yeah. Can, they can do that for you over Amazon? Yeah, they have Amazon Fresh, dude. Oh, shit. I wonder, can you get, uh, fro- you probably can't get frozen stuff, obviously, but. I think you might be able to get frozen stuff, but I know you can't. I don't think you can get fresh fresh stuff like produce or, or milk or shit like that. Oh, I don't do. Well, I'll, I'll look at that now. Let's, uh, all right, right you know what, man? You know what I drink? I've, I've tr- tried lately. That almond milk, man. You ever drink it's that? It's good, isn't it? It is good. I like it. Fucking good, dude. You, put, get, you, you ever get, get some cereal with that shit? Make a bowl of cereal, dude? There, oh, oh, yeah. Well, actually, I, I don't usually do cereal with it, but I, I just drink it sometimes in the morning. You know, I'm like, hey, this is good so shit. Who, who, did you tell me? To, did, I, did I tell you to get that? Or just, I, you oh, know what? It was Mac Metro was talking about it, and I was like, you know. Because I've been drinking that for a while. Also, try the almond milk, and then also the uh, the uh, cashew milk is good, too. Oh, really? Hmm. It's got cashew and almond, and, it, and it's, it doesn't spoil that, that. You can even drink it warm. You can leave it out if you want. You don't want to. You know, I, I know Jerkman loves to drink nut milk, and so maybe, you know, he, he he would enjoy that. Maybe I should ask him. Yeah, but his, he, usually likes, he usually likes the kind that are, that are like, have a little sweaty, like almost a Gatorade taste to it. <laughs> you know, like, because you have to be like sweaty, like sweaty nut juice. Right, exactly. Instead of your electrolytes, they're your ejaculites, right? <laughs> yeah, ejaculates. <laughs> so... Or, or, or electro pipe. Electro pipes, yeah. Electrolytes. Erectolites. Erectolites. <laughs> <laughs> he needs those cause, because of his condition. Oh. <laughs> Wow, <laughs> that's funny. They don't call it, they don't call it power aid for nothing. <laughs> and again, he he'd probably drink gay torade. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's fun to rip on him, and he can't say anything. <laughs> well, he's, yeah, he's, he's probably gonna, yeah. Well, whatever. Yeah. Anyway, um, so yeah, so this that's funny. It's, this is like how, how technology shifts your shifts your shifts your thinking, man. Shifts your thinking, man, because I don't. I get out cash and I'm like, wait, you have cash, so you just, and I still send it. I still break out my card sometimes. Like, wait, I got forty dollars. Oh, I have cash. Oh, <laughs> I've done that. I'll I'm pull the card out. I don't need to use my card. I've got because you don't. And this is the thing is for you. I understand why you don't get fucking have to fold your. You don't have to origami your fucking bills. Yep. Or put them in cards. separate pockets or dumb shit like that. You know what I'm saying? You know, you, know, you just pull out your fucking card and you order, get criticized about how you fucking fold your bills. Oh for yeah. Two five hours in a. Burger King or where the fuck I was. <laughs> yeah, that's uh, yeah, or, or well, you know, what's that? Oh, go ahead. Matt. Oh, I was just gonna say yeah, or even have to you know take a trip to the ATM. It's a fu- that's a fucking pain in the ass. So I might as well just use my card, you know? Yeah, exactly. It's it's in ordering this from everywhere. It's, it's fucking great. But speaking of burgers, dude, you need Kraken needs to take you. Uh, on Trop and Jones, or someone to take you. Maybe even go with with Mac Metro or somebody else. Uh huh. Can't, can't go with G Motors anymore. Oh, G Motors misses <laughs> out. Of course, you know what he'll do too. He'll text me and tell me about all these burger places and all these things, and I'm like, uh, we don't have that out here, man. <laughs> you know, he he yeah, was pro- you know, like 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 uh, probably like uh, what's what's it called? Uh, Hardee's. Yeah, or, or or like he was telling me about the uh, hot dog at Burger King that they have, and I'm like, huh? And remember, we looked it up. I think we looked it up, and yeah. uh, you guys were like, what? What the That's fuck? The South man, they got a bunch of crazy shit. You know, I, I bags, know. You know? <laughs> I know. White supremacy. That's that's because we're a white supremacist country. <laughs> the, the black president. Yeah. Yeah. Because um, there's and, a lot of uh, white privilege, you know. But but speak but burgers. Speaking of burgers, do you, you know you remember rallies, right? Yeah. Hell yeah. Okay, Rally's was one of my favorite burger places. Oh, I think I know what you're going to tell me, dude. Is it, um, oh, shit. There's, what's the name? 
Checkers. Checkers. Yeah, yeah. There's a Checkers by me actually. It's on. Uh, I went there with G Motors actually before, before a little before was he it, left. Was it good? It was good, dude. It's the same fries, you know, like they used to have. Yeah, fucking awesome. And season fries, and the burgers are good, right? The burgers are great, and then those those ejaculatory ass um, banana shakes, dude. Those mm-hmm. things are awesome. Oh. Yeah, see, so, so see, I wanted to make sure you knew about those, like, because there's one on Shrop and Jones too. Oh, that's close to where we work. Crack that's what I'm there. So, so if you guys can go there, you guys can hit up lunch and, and try to get those fries whenever you want to. Hey, you know, Kraken's very, uh, very finicky, man. It's kind of weird. He's like, oh, it's not quality food. <laughs> it's kind of weird. He's he's like that sometimes. Very picky. Well, this is this, this, uh, would you, I would consider this quality fast food. Yeah, but he always finds something to to Uh-oh. bitch. You know. I, think I lost you guys. Did you? Uh, we can hear you. I think. It's saying I'm still on here. I can I can hear you. You can't hear me. All right. Can you hear me? I can hear you. Can you hear me? Huh. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and try to. Okay, we're gonna go to break and we're gonna see what's going on. We'll be right back, bitches. If you're a fan of hip-hop and R&B, join me, the Bruh Bruh Ren, for a full non-stop hour of back-to-back slappers. Uh, back-to-back slappers. Where the playlist spans from genres like R&B, soul, R&B, soul. o'clock pacific standard time and saturday at midnight eastern standard time only on the tough love show on j and j dot fm hey, hey, hey most people don't most plan, people to, don't fail, plan to, fail, to fail but a lot of people fail people to plan, plan and it really don't have to be like that what you know about an ira or a tax deferred 401k what you gotta pay to the government ever heard of a tax exempt retirement that's info most folks don't know what you gonna do if you live too long what you gonna do if you die too soon can your spouse afford the house will your family go bankrupt if you get sick you got a plan in place to cover medical debt i'm not talking about ad deal i'm speaking on long-term deal you ever seen a bill from that home where big mama went to live it's like seventy three thousand dollars a year how you gonna pay for that 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 you work hard every day but you really don't like it you're looking at a retirement crisis got a good education got a good job got the age and the time but still got robbed in 2008 when the market crashed want to tell your boss to kiss your bus pass but you can't cause you upside down and your savings on life support right now Said you can't cause you upside down and your savings on life support right now So you wake up in the morning and you put on your game face Then you run out the house late headed to the same place On the bus like I'm stuck, 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 stuck In your car like I'm stuck, 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 stuck what you need is a solution more income and less confusion what you gonna do where you gonna go who you gonna talk to to get the info and get money you can talk to me you can talk to me we got what you need and you can join the team 
Build yourself, then build your wealth by sharing what you learn with somebody else. Each one, teach one how money works. Stay compliant so nobody gets hurt. Move like a union, be ambitious. We all independent, follow the system. Move like a union, be ambitious. We all independent, follow the system. Hey, this is Travis. This song was recorded to get your attention. I have some powerful financial information that you should hear. The things that you need to put in place for a solid financial foundation in case you live too long, die too soon.